I work with some of the most vulnerable people in Queensland who often have been failed by the system time and time again, who've got nobody else. And I support them to live in our communities and to live full and satisfying lives. In schools, um, a lot of people think that there's only teachers, but there's a lot of other public service positions and I'm one of them. I'm responsible for the financial uh, management of the school and also maintaining the facilities. We all work together to make the school clean and um, safe for students. Our job's important to the community to um, make sure that re we rehabilitate offenders and to keep the community safe. I know that they're trying to tell us that they're bringing in award modernisation but really they're just wanting to take away our rights and conditions and our ability to, to stand up and say that we don't like what they're putting forward. They've cut back on our rosters. Uh, a lot of people are now losing quite a substantial amount of money because of that. It really makes it hard on the local communities, it makes it hard on the families. Morale is um, not real good. It would certainly make it harder for us to do our jobs and it would mean that we wouldn't have the services and supports for the people that really need it. They just don't seem to um, care about these people who a lot of them are being victims themselves. One of the, the big things around change management is to actually engage and involve staff and workers in the change. If you don't talk to us then how do you know how it's going to be, how it's going to work, how we're going to make it work. There just seems to be more and more that we have to do with less resources and it's been an issue for a number of years now. I've got kids and family on the outside and uh, the most important thing is for uh, myself uh, to come home to them and also uh, for the prisoners to get released in the community and go home to their families and be better people. The people I work with show great initiative and they are a pleasure to work with, to see them take pleasure in the small things in their lives that they attain and do. It's, it's a wonderful feeling for me to be able to work alongside them and walk with them and guide them. And I would really hate to see that change and for, for positions like mine to, to go. We're the only ones that can make the change to make a difference is when we stick together. Join with your colleagues, join your union, you know, let's, let's stand and fight this because we are, if we have enough voices, we, we will be heard. You know, the example last year when we had 150 prison officers in full uniform marching up the main street of Mareeva and sent a very clear message. We got the people of the community and the town talking. They realised that uh, if there's privatisation or anything happens, if there's any job losses in those regional or rural areas, that um, they're going to lose money, it's going to affect them as well.